What we've been seeing starting in late October is a number of our images being uh, illegally taken from our site and used by other sites in a fraudulent way, uh, claiming to sell our products. We had some customers call us and, and go, hey, why can't I buy this coat for half the price at this other website? And that was kind of jarring because we knew it, that couldn't possibly be true uh, since you can only buy from, from Overland. And then we started seeing ads on Google and Facebook and Instagram using our own imagery. Um, it quickly snowballed from there, from one or two sites uh, to the point where now we have well over a thousand that we've identified. And the process has been quite a painstaking process to find the same actor is basically repeating um, the same scam over and over again. As soon as you shut one site down, they open up another one. Uh, so we've been trying to work on how to more quickly identify and stop that process and try to enlist the, the help of companies like Shopify, uh, where the majority of the sites are hosted, to get their help and enlist the, their help in preventing consumer fraud. Now, if they know us and they're already a customer, they know the quality of the products can't possibly be matched at you know, a 20th of the price. Um, the bigger story and the bigger issue is not so much with our customer base as it is with uh, people who've never heard of Overland or don't know what kind of product they're looking at or the quality that's in that product. Uh, and so they're seeing a, a $3,000 coat online in an image um, and thinking that, oh, $60, that's a great deal. Well, you can't possibly get that coat for $60, but they're getting um, completely scammed and getting something that that doesn't have any resemblance uh, to the real thing once they do. And it's, that's a frustrating thing and it's affecting thousands of customers um, nationwide.